Am I crazy, or does this look like something we've seen before? <laughs> They say about the crazy ones. Huh? Welcome to Strong Arm Flicks. I'm your boy T Flame, and this is episode 42 of Strong Arm Flicks. So, look at what we have here today. David Ayer has dropped. A couple of images on Twitter um, the other day um, for the air cut and I have been saying for a while he's been being real laid back he's been being real coy about it um, he put up a post and said something about uh, you know that um, basically uh, if somebody asked him if he would be willing to uh, make a commentary about uh, Suicide Squad the way that uh, Zack Snyder did a director's commentary for BVS, and he basically said, I would never work again. <laughs> Insinuating basically that, uh, you know, as we all already knew, that this was not his cut, and that he's got so much to say about it, he'd probably never be able to get a job again. So, um, that begs the question, um, what to do about David Ayer, Suicide Squad? What to do about the Ayer cut? And um, a lot of people that I uh, know that are close in the Snyder Cut movement said that basically um, a lot of them, a lot of people in the movement are on board with uh, starting the campaign and starting to uh, rally for the air cut. But um, there is a few of them that say, you know, well, he's not directly coming out and saying, hey, that wasn't my cut, this and that. Um, in various different ways he has, though, but this is the most recent his, this is his way of hinting at the air cut. And, uh, uh, you know, a guy go, you know, went back and uh, he brought it to my attention. And he said, he said that, um, you know, if you look in the first, he, there were some images brought up from the first official trailer for Suicide Squad, not the, 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 the sneak peek at Comic-Con, the first official trailer for Suicide Squad. And near the end of the trailer, um, there was a there's an image that was paused and zoomed in just right, and you can clearly tell. And here it is, right here. You can clearly tell that this is fucking parademons. I never noticed this shit before. So does this mean that there is a cut of Suicide Squad that has a fully rendered step Steppenwolf, fucking menacing Steppenwolf from BBS, and fucking uh, demonic? parademons and instead of that cgi ooze blast into the sky it's fucking gears like and 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 that this is supposed to be a, dev a, a apocalyptic um gear set from the planet apocalypse a uh, um a apocalyptic uh prehistoric boom tube if you will and this is the way that they are trying to get steppenwolf through the portal in Suicide Squad, let me know what you guys think about that. Because I think that that's fucking out of control and that if there is a cut sitting out there somewhere and it's got Steppenwolf and Parademons in it and the storyline that connects to BBS and connects to Justice League, this shit needs to come out yesterday. Release the fucking air cut. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe to me because I'll be bringing more DC and DCEU content. So please sub to me for all of that shit. Till next time, my friends.